Hey guys, I'm Amarat and last time I have shown you how to create NPCs with equipment. So create some sort of new custom display ID for creature with items on it. But there was one part uh, we uh, didn't talk about and those are weapons. Because when you want to assign weapons to NPC, you need to do it by using database. Actually, you can't do it in uh, client edits, in mods. Uh, so what we are looking at here is uh, one NPC or actually three different NPCs with the same display ID but with different weapons in their items. Uh, so how can you do this and how can you make NPC use both both ranged and melee weapons or maybe even offhand weapon and so on. That's something I would like to talk about in this video or I would like to start with this in this video. So first of all, we've got three NPCs in Creature Template. Nothing special about that. Just three generic NPCs. You're right. Nothing special, nothing extra. Uh, and uh, when you want to create NPCs which have weapons, you need to go into Creature Equip Template. In Creature Equip Template, you can see that these three NPCs have records here and uh, they have assigned items three items. You can use up to three items. The first one is right hand, the second one is left hand, and the third one is actually ranged weapon or ranged sword. You can see that all three of those NPCs have actually all three weapons and uh, the same weapons, but why do they look different in game? Uh, this NPC appears to have no weapons at all, but when I attack it, you can see that it actually has the same weapons as this one. This NPC seems to have bow only, but when I attack that NPC on melee, it uses the same weapons yet again. So you can see that those NPCs here do have the same weapons, but they are using them in different way. This one has by default, default no weapons, or weapons are sheathed. This NPC is by default using ranged weapon, and melee weapons are sheathed. And this NPC is by default using melee weapons, and ranged weapon is sheathed. How do you do it? Well, you need to use uh, the third uh, table here, and that's Creature Template Add-on. And in Creature Template Add-on, in Bytes to field, you can do many different things, but what you can do also is select uh, which weapons are to be used. If you use Bytes to as a zero, uh, that means that NPC is supposed to have all weapons sheathed and use them only when a uh, fight occurs. Uh, if you use uh, bytes to set to 1, uh, then NPC is using melee weapons. And if you use bytes to value 2, NPC will uh, use ranged weapon by default. Now, uh, that's zero 08. If you want to make uh, archers with bows and so on, use bytes 2. If you want to uh, create guards, use bytes 1. And uh, using flag uh, 0, which means all weapons sheathed, that's something you would probably rather use. Uh, now, there, there's one last thing, and that's using of different than uh, right hand weapon. Uh, what, do you, what do you have to do if you have two weapons and want your NPC to use both of them, actually, dual wield? What, what do you do if you want to have dual wielding NPC? Or what do you do if you want NPC which is actually shooting its bow? Because uh, this NPC now won't be using that bow. When I attack it with some random... You can see that that NPC will actually pursue me and use melee weapon and instead of shooting at me. Uh, that's because it doesn't have a set uh, ranged attacks. And the only way I'm aware of uh, in Trinity Core to make uh, NPCs use ranged attacks is actually uh, by using scripts, for example, smart AI and so on. Uh, I will talk about smart scripts in dedicated video. But just for now, if you want to use, uh, use ranged attacks with NPCs, you need to make smart script for that NPC, which tells that NPC to use some shoot uh, spell. Find some shoot spell, assign it to NPC, make that NPC use that shoot spell uh, when uh, target is at distance and so on, and that's how you make NPC shoot. I will show you how to do that in dedicated video if you don't know how to do that uh, by now. 
but really that's how you that's the only way of doing it by using spells and smart scripts that's how you make npcs shoot or use open weapon otherwise npcs will always use just their right hand for attacking and just their new weapons and ranged weapon is just for looks or to be used with ranged spells that's shoot spell for example so that's really it guys there's nothing more to this just that simple uh, but I didn't want to make uh, the last video too long. So that's really it for now. Uh, I hope this was useful for you. And as always, happy modding and happy going of NPCs. Bye guys.